No, no. Get out. No, no. There's Richie. No, no. <laughs> Mad in his business. Yeah. No, no, no. So, uh, do you know? God damn. Hi, you guys. First of all, I'd like to say welcome back to a new vlog. So, today's vlog is really going to be a bit of journey taking. This is my living room and off my living room is a balcony. Are you ready to see what is out here? Five, four, three, two, one. Oh my gosh, you guys. This is what it now looks like. So I rewind to a couple of years back when I got it looking super cute. I had painted the floor grey. You can see the brown starting to come through a little bit. But it's actually lasted quite a while. Painted the wall white. It was like a brown, I think, before. Um, so there's a lot that's going to happen out here. From this angle, you can see the amazing views that I get and the amazing size of this balcony and you can see that it's roofed and everything. So it is a really, really great space to have and to own um, and I'm just kind of sick and tired of it going to waste now and I want it back, especially right now. The birds have lived here for a long, long time. They have, I'm sure there are a few nests in that corner that we're going to have to clear out. Um, that's the door from the living room and you can see there's shit there. There's piles of poo under here. I don't know if you can see it, but there is. So I'm going to document what we get up to and it's going to be very, very interesting. How cute is this, you guys? Oh my gosh. I absolutely love this. Can you see like the mirrors? It kind of creates a whole like courtyard feel and makes it feel a lot bigger. Love it. This is like the inspo, but I'm gonna have grass on the floor because I cannot be asked to paint that floor again. I do wanna get some nice cushions for the bench and for the seats out there so stuff like this also this is so beautiful did i screen grab this yeah i did i showed my mum yesterday um that I, it made me feel like should i actually spray my set gold instead and give it that rich luxe kind of feel so here's some of the corporates you guys like there's usually like up to 10 there's probably a few hidden I think there's going to be a nest around there that we're going to have to clear out in that corner. I think there's going to be a zoo around there. A zoo? Yeah. Eggs. <laughs> Introduce yourself. I am Jade Van Riel. Nice. What are you going to do? Well, you know, today I have the most luxurious bonnet. Mm. This bonnet literally is protecting my braids from all sorts of madness out there. Damn, homie. Um, so this, let's okay. say fifty pounds. Oh, damn. Worth it. Damn, homie. And then my sports bra, it's so damn hot outside, is fifteen. Damn, homie. From like TK Maxx or something. Mm -hmm. These have seen better days. Ooh, yeah. <laughs> these are from Zara. They come with a top. Yeah. I think these are probably about fifteen pounds by themselves, but they let off. That's why I'm using them today, and they're probably going to get thrown away. Yep. And then we got good. Ooh. old I mean, sorry about the the feathers. We got the Ergs, you know. God damn. Oh, this one's getting a hole now. Damn, well, well, vintage, isn't it? Vintage. Vintage means let's give it a thousand pounds. Damn. Damn. Priceless. Swag it out. <laughs> I am ready. Let's the so let me give you guys an update on what has been happening. So to start with, we're brushing it all to the middle which seems like the best option right now and we'll just do it a couple of times um to just get everything i have to close the door because it's blowing in here and we're gonna scoop it up into the black bags get those downstairs get everything out <laughs> look at the wind babe we need to just break that yeah we need to break that wood we need to break that wood that wood, we need to just break it. 
Do you know what I mean? Yeah. Um, so yeah, all these wooden planks are from like my kitchen and bathroom when we redid it. And they've just been sat out here, so. Yeah, it's all gonna go. Ooh, the wind is getting my baby. Thank you so much, babe. He is so helpful right now. I would usually be doing this and I feel so blessed to have someone to help me today because I've done this a couple of times since living here. Um, the last year, last year when I did it, it was this bad. And um, I'm so used to doing it myself that right now I'm like, what do I do? But he's just kind of taken over. He's found a bird's nest in the bin. That's a nest right there. Can you see that, you guys? So I basically one day left this bin out here to like, I usually air out my bins. And then when I started seeing the pigeons, I was like, okay, I ain't picking that bin back up. I might be able to salvage this table and chairs, possibly. Um, doesn't look great, but I'm gonna show you guys a before and after DIY for sure. I'm gonna show y'all. Cause I think, it's, I think it can be saved. So we have got rid of about six black bags of wood, rubbish, plant pots, um, all the tiles that I used for my bathroom, the remaining ones, they're now downstairs in my storage cupboard. So I have determined to try and clean these. My boyfriend's looking at me like I'm crazy, but I think I can do it, you guys. So now we have somewhat blank canvas now we're going to start cleaning sweeping and shoveling all of this again round two and then once we do that i'll start pouring the hot water and bleach everywhere and then like leave it all and just start rinsing out so there is a gutter is it like a gutter hole there it's still a glorious glorious day you guys but i'm really proud of what we've done so far so yeah there's lots to do including cleaning all the windows yes we have done a lot I feel elated. Sorry, things are flying in here, but it's just it's just leaves. Getting a bit scared. Um anyway, my boys, both of them are waiting for me. Can you see them there? I don't know if you can see them. Yeah, there they are. I'm so happy though. This I'm gonna knock down. Yeah, let's get on with it. Right, this is going, you guys. <gasps> Woo! This is brilliant. Oh my god, I've hated this thing forever. I painted it white to blend in. This is amazing, I can just paint the wall white. We've done so much. It might not look like it right now, but trust me. All the feathers and the shit is up. We've been sweeping. Got another bag there. Got that one, babe? Hey. I am so happy that it's gone. Okay, so we're gonna yeah, pull now this. I'm gonna off. get this off here, that's why. I know, what? I don't even know how it's attached. <laughs> Oh, oh, <laughs> is that one gonna, raw? This has always been there, it was just wooden and I painted it. Oh, wow, okay, I'm gonna get new ones. Hey Richie, you being so well behaved, aren't you? You had your moments, but you've been all right. It is so clean and it's not even clean clean yet. This is gonna be amazing. So Bay is drilling. We actually don't even need to drill, we're just doing a little tiny hole and then twisting the hooks in. And this is the net here, you guys. This is what we got. There's a lot of it, so we won't be needing all of it, but it's good to have backups, I suppose. There's Richie. <laughs> Mad in his business. Good morning, you guys. So I actually don't even know what time it is. I haven't actually looked at my phone this morning. Um, but I wanted to show you the balcony. Now, funny, funny thing happened. Somehow last night, one bird pigeon did actually get in. 
and sat on the light which is what they tend to do and I tried everything to get it out by like putting the light on and off and it just wouldn't budge so it stayed there all all night so this morning I came out saw the same bird by the way yes it pooed because I, I actually cleaned um that little ledge yesterday and there's poo there thank you thanks a lot i am about to have some lunch right we're about to have some lunch and there is just one pigeon stuck in here all of its friends have left it and essentially what i've seen them do is just like creep and crawl underneath there so just walk out thank you get out right the good news you guys is i went to wix and i got bamboo so this is going right up as soon as i am done with my lunch <laughs> because i've had enough of them trying to come in I'm scared to do this corner, babe. Could you do it? What corner? Yeah. Yeah, cool. Yeah? <laughs> Thank you. I'm scared of that. That's it, dude. Sponge painting over these spots and just any imperfections right now. I don't think I've got enough because I only got a little can, but what I will do is go over it a little bit more with like just normal um, white paint that I have just to kind of seal it, but I think it's gonna work. Ta-da! Look how good that wall looks. It looks as good as new. Um, that's all the painting I'm gonna do for today. Um, so the floor's all cleared. We're getting rid of everything now and we're gonna start laying down the grass. So, my table and chairs came out pretty decent as well, but I'll show you guys properly in a little bit. Right now, I need to do this floor. So here it is, you guys. This looks so good. This looks good. Mm -hmm. I like this. Okay, let's get it out there. It won't go away. It's really upset that it's not allowed to come in. Good. Richie, what do you think of it so far? Do you like it? Oh, babe, look, he likes it. Look. I am pleasantly surprised with how much we were able to do today and so far. So a little round up, this is day two. There is not much to do tomorrow other than um, to spray these black, which I may do after dinner or I might just do it tomorrow because it's been a long day and dinner is cooking. I've got a nice Sunday dinner going on. Richie clearly loves it out here. He's getting really excited. All that's left to do tomorrow is get some more of the bamboo. We're gonna get two more bits and I'm gonna put one the same level and one slightly higher to cover the black railing there. So I think that will look really good. I'm really happy with how the table and chairs turned out as well. You guys, I'm really, really happy. But this is what's going on inside here. So yeah, I gotta sort all of this stuff out. In fact, I'm gonna put these outside now because I'm gonna use these tomorrow to spray those. The view from inside. So this is the current view. I still need to figure out what I'm going to do about the TV stand and the chair. Obviously it's original place is where it was, but during the summer whilst I'm like walking out there, I just need a little bit of a walkway. And then when I actually have a gathering, obviously I'll do a whole move. Today is bank holiday Monday and I am literally in my painter's outfit. I'm about to do a couple of finishing touches. So I, myself and the boyfriend just put these mirrors up, which to be honest, they are temporary up because we couldn't get any nails this wall is a solid like wall with metal inside it so we are just gonna make do for this for now but kind of scared that they're gonna fall so I'm gonna try and find like some strong command strips for mirrors and see if those will work 
so yeah I'll probably do that another day I just I can't go back outside because I, I don't want them too far apart like this I actually wanted we were trying to do it over there which is why there's so many holes a new layout for the living room <laughs> I have moved the armchair to here which actually looks all right it's a little bit messy because of stuff on there the mirror we're gonna put up today finally and um, yeah this corner just looks a lot neater without the sofa there but also allows for a little walkway out so it's actually quite perfect like if I sit down you can see the TV obviously we can move it if we need to but at least the furniture is actually fine there's still loads of room here so it's looking good it's looking good and the big reveal you guys Ta -da! so the mirrors are black now and they look so so good black i also really love it because you can see in to the living room through here so it looks so cool we've got the rosé ready because i think we're gonna have some drinks out here and say cheese <laughs> and um i've just got a little bit of a jungle going on here not enough not near enough i don't know where they're actually gonna go but they're gonna stay there for now and you know what this looks a lot lighter on camera but it is a lot darker in real life um if i come up close see you can see all the black <laughs> so the camera just makes it look super light and so this is not the big big reveal because there's still lots that i want to do i have a bench coming at some point this week hopefully i have this which i plan to like put in the corner and wrap some like faux flowers and foliage around it some more plants so it is going to have an upgrade but this is the before and after and process over the weekend so it took us like two and a half days to just get it to this place which is brilliant i hope you guys have enjoyed this video and yeah give it a comment give it a like subscribe if you're new keep an eye out for the final final balcony tour because it's gonna be epic like if you think this is lovely i can't wait to add some more to it so see you guys very very soon bye bank holiday snacks the pink moscato and all that yummy